Hi Libra, thanks for visiting. This is your reading for November 2019. And if you like this reading, please like, subscribe and comment if that's what you'd like to do. You know, love and appreciate you also very much for all of your support on my channel. And for private readings specific to you, please visit katietarot.com. So Libra, let's take a look at the month ahead. Let's see what spirit your angels and guides would like to bring through for you. For Libra. This reading is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus sign Libra. And it is a general reading, so please take what resonates for you personally and just leave what doesn't. This is where you are currently Libra. This is what's below you, what's behind you, what's above you and what is coming in towards you. Let's take a look at your first message. We have the Eight of Michael and it says you can be free. Make a courageous choice to change your situation, not seeing things clearly. So there's really a situation going on here for you, Libra, this month where you are going to free yourself. It may be mentally, it could be emotionally, it could from, be from a physical situation, uh, say a workplace that doesn't resonate with you anymore or any any situation that doesn't resonate with you anymore, Libra, you're going to be able to break free of this, open up your mindset, open up your opportunities. I'm seeing an offer coming through for you once you break free of what is containing you, once you break free of what no longer serves you. I'm getting a sense when this transition, when this turning point comes about, Libra, this month, people around you, they're not going to know what to do because they may not expect this from you. They may expect you to continue on with the status quo or to continue on with the same um, scenario, the same drama, the same dynamic between you and them. That's not going to be the case. You're breaking free. You're not going to be giving away your power anymore, Libra. You're going to be uplifted vibrationally. And this is through your own choices and actions. So an amazingly powerful energy I'm feeling for you here in the month of November, Libra. They really won't know what to do. So this is exciting for you because you're showing you're showing your true colors. You're showing how you really want to be. You're taking the steps that you're guided to take intuitively. So an amazing energy coming through there for you, Libra. Let's take a look at these cards for additional information. And we have the door and this is opportunities are waiting for you. And yes, I do feel that with that first card coming through, I was feeling that once you release the old and you um, and you do this in a very purposeful and intentional way, doors are going to open for you, Libra. You're going to have opportunities coming in that wouldn't have been there if you didn't make this choice. We have the ladder climbing towards success. Both, both of these cards are very successful cards and energies, Libra. You're climbing towards success in, in this particular area of your life. And it is going to be different for everybody, of course. So it may be romantic for some. It could be in the workplace or career for others. It could be in a family dynamic or a friendship with, uh, with someone else. You're going to have to place this energy where it fits. We have the dog energy, which is protection from a powerful friend. So you have an ally. And so perhaps this is how you help yourself. They help you and therefore you can help yourself in this situation because you have someone to rely upon. You have a really close friend or person close to you. Uh, it could be a co-worker or a boss. It could be um, a family member. It could be your partner. You've got a powerful person around you that is extremely loyal. And so this is a person you can rely upon to help you and uplift you in your time of need. This could be vice versa as well, remember. So these readings can be vice versa. You may see these qualities in another person and you are the friend. You're uplifting them. And we have the bull. Do not back down from opposition. Show strength and fortitude. So once you make this decision, Libra, you're going to have to stick to it. Okay, it's very important to not back down and remain in your strength, remain in your power. And I see most part you're going to be doing that. And even though some people may not know, uh, you know, how to act or what to say or what to do, given this, given your 
choice given your circumstance and the changes that you're t that you're making in your life which are which are very empowering there's an energy here of you not backing down and you sticking to your guns on this and you just doing what needs to be done even though they don't know what to say or do or how to act or they may be acting strange you know this isn't going to bother you let's take a look at the next card we have the pale time to get out of a situation it is time to go libra it's time to go or it's time to recognize and have an awareness that a change is in the works for you and that you need to go and make some choices and change a situation in your life it may not be completely letting go of a situation or a person or a relationship but it is time to change the energy so very powerful energy coming through from spirit in terms of these energies so let's take a look at your next card and we have attraction and it says you attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully so in terms of love and romance you've got attraction around you someone is going to feel the chemistry with you there's attraction from you to them or them toward you in terms of general energies libra attraction indicates that you are being attracted to your right path and you know exactly which way to go now you know you're you're feeling divinely guided about this and you're going to follow your true path and you're going where the attraction is we have the desert prince and it says survival and false promises now survival you're going to be okay you know this may be quite a big shake up for some of you this big change and transition that I'm seeing for you and perhaps the energies of other people coming towards you perhaps because they don't know how to act or what to say uh, given your choices there is a sense here of perhaps you feeling or thinking even though you're very empowered that there may be a delay or there may be some difficulty in improving your situation at least at least in the interim you know at least in the next you know few weeks it may feel like it's going to be drawn out further and further and further now i'm seeing with this card that that's not the case if someone says to you that you know okay things are going to change we're going to i'm got you know the company is going to give you a raise um, stay in the company or when you tell them about your your indication to to leave or to want to change a situation someone says to you you know it could be a partner okay I'm going to change you know this type of thing just be aware of false promises okay just be aware of that and remain in integrity with yourself and remain committed to removing yourself from this situation that has outlived its time okay you're going to survive things are going to be okay talking about financial things and if this is a concern for you or perhaps emotionally you're worried about survival in any kind of way spirit's going to look after you okay this is a really good um, really good energy for moving on and for and for taking that big leap in your life and going to that next step going to the next stage so this is confirmation from spirit saying to you that yes you know the doors are going to open for you further possibilities and options are available to you once you make this choice and you stick to your point stick to your focus on this all right so let's take a look at where you are currently so you're not entirely happy here we have the four of cups even though you know you've got, you've got some good things going on perhaps emotionally um, you're feeling okay about things you know they're fairly stable but there are some underlying issues which really do not suit you well you've out they've outlived their purpose or you know it doesn't doesn't serve you to live in this way anymore or to be in this circumstance anymore so you're going to be uplifted vibrationally and supported spiritually in making this transition and we have the hangman and I'm not surprised this energy has come up because I was feeling with this desert prince energy that perhaps there is a feeling here of it being delayed or you're afraid that's going to happen well that's come from the past okay because things have not moved forward for you the hangman indicates that things have been quite stagnant even though you've learned through this process you've been quite stagnant there's an energy here of of non-movement and of just staying in one place even if it has not been serving you well like I say you've been learning through this process and, and through this journey however now I'm seeing that it is time to let go of the old and welcome in the new 
We have the tower energy here in your immediate past. So some of you may have been very aware that something is on really shaky ground. And this may mean an outside event. It may mean that there is um, choices within yourself that you realize may need to change, you know, circumstances or internal dialogue and things like this. And it, something's not built on solid ground. So things are having to change. And that's why you're not happy with it because um, it doesn't suit you anymore. It doesn't fit with you anymore. And look at this. We have the Ace of Swords looking to the future. This energy is coming in for some of you and also around you presently for others. So you're looking to the future with clear, a clear mind, a, a sense of clarity here. And so you're going to, I'm seeing you're going to say no. You know, if anyone comes at you with any negativity, you're going to stop them and say no. You appreciate that they don't really know, you know, they didn't expect you to make this decision or choice, but you're going to stop them and say, no, I'm not going to be, you've got your barriers up here for protection. You're not going to be listening to any negativity or taking on any of this energy. It's not necessary moving forward. We have a brand new beginning here for you. We have the Hermit energy, a beautiful, powerful energy, Libra. There may be a Virgo around you as well. Now, this Hermit energy means you are following your true path. You are finding out what truly is right for you. And that is the most empowering thing. And the most empowering message from this, from this reading, I feel for you, is that you are going to make a choice this month in November of breaking free of a constriction or a situation that no longer serves you. And you're going to be moving along the path that is right for you finally. Okay, so this is a very empowering, empowering reading because no matter what people say or how they do, because they're not going to know what to think when you make this choice. So the thing is, you're going to be strong enough and I'm seeing you're going to have the fortitude and the courage and the support as well from a particular person to make this change. So an amazing reading for you Libra this month. I hope you have a wonderful month ahead and I'll talk to you all again soon.